Minnesota first, seven and ten in the Big Ten, and Murphy going to work off the spin, and that's exactly what he does when he's going well. Both inside and out that makes him complete with the 51 threes on the year. And now Amir Coffey, who really needs to get it going for Minnesota. Don't and he needs think? to do just that. You're going to have people's attention. He's been ridiculous from three-point range. How about that defense? He's also been often awesome defensively. Coffey up and under for two. A little circus shot. Robbie going for understatement of the night early. <laughs> Coffey into like the lane for two and a foul. I like this, Amir Coffey. Defensively, they've done enough. Over the, that four-game stretch, only giving up 62 points a game. But on the offensive end of the floor, as we see a Northwestern breakdown defensively. It's an 8-2 run for Northwestern. Coffey skating into the lane. And that, couple possessions separated, is the difference between Coffey when he's driving. Got Miller Cop's arm going up. I'm not sure it's the best shot in the world, but... He just grimaced at Keith Kimball on the way by. Didn't say anything, but did make a face as Coffey fills it up for three. You can see players that are really good, and, and when they go through slumps, it, it could be hard. You know, it could be soul searching. Corey Brewer once told me in Minnesota that when he plays bad, he gets on synergy and watches all of his mates. 33 yesterday. That'll be at Staples Center. Coverage starts NBA Countdown 7 Eastern on ESPN and the ESPN app. Suggested that it was one of those moments where he's thinking, well, he won't do that in a couple years as Murphy scores for Minnesota. It's been a struggle. It's been fundamental deals. Coffee goes baseline and scores. That was a big time hesitation move by Amir Coffee. Change in speed. Broken that and expanded the lead to 12 again. Coffee's just driving harder than we've seen recently, and McRae sticks it from the senior. Run out, Oturu. Look out. Northwestern is four for 17 from three. The jump shots just have not been there, and Coffees have another three. That's a great question. I don't have the answer for it. Oh, McBrayer, a helium ball to Coffee to tie his career high. Hanging on rims tonight here in Evanston. Keeping up with coffee has been difficult tonight. For play tonight, and he let us know before the game, he felt like winning two of three was what Minnesota needed to do to feel good as Oturu attacks the rim. 